I just want to offer praise to former Assemblyman Harvey Wiesenberg, who spent his career, although he's not serving now, to get to the very moment that we are about to vote on. Many people in this body on both sides of the aisle pushed this over the goal line very admirably. But it was Harvey Wiesenberg for years, sometimes by himself, who carried this all the way down the field. Uh, some of you know former Assemblyman Harvey Wiesenberg um, has a, a developmentally disabled son, and he talks to direct care workers almost every day. He watches them change diapers. He watches them uh, give showers, change bedding, and do all the other tasks that no one else wants to do, and yet it has become more lucrative and, and uh, desirable for people to flip hamburgers and fast food restaurants. Harvey was talking about this when no one else was, and I've been in rooms where people, not knowing my relationship to Harvey Wiesenberg, and by the way, he's the reason I'm standing here today, have said things like, Harvey seems like a good guy, but he only cares about that disability issue. That's like saying, Gandhi, that guy only cares about peace. George Washington, he only cared about beginning a country. It's crazy. Harvey Wiesenberg has been the voice of people who for so long had no voice, and this is the measure he pushed for. And by the way, in his retirement, this is all he thinks about, cares about, and advocates for. So to all of us here today who helped push this over the goal line, this is a great thing. To Harvey Wiesenberg, wherever you are, I actually know where he is, but back in Long Beach, thank you so much for your hard work. It is incredible. We are all in your debt. I vote aye, Mr. President.